we were arguing like every day. Let's get the fuck out of here. Kitchen nightmares, like where I'm Ramsey gonna come in here and be like, let's change everything. I'm about to cry. We're starting OnlyFans. trying to switch up my work outfits so I'll show y'all what I packed but it's the same thing that I always wear very realistic I got my mock turtleneck shirt you know I got this one I have my black one then I have chinos some beige chinos that'll go with the blue top and then I got some like gray chinos that will go with the black top. So it's a two day trip. So I only got to pack two work outfits. I got some brown loafers and I get my black loafers. Bow. Only other thing I got to go grab is our, my workout outfits. We have to build a little bit better. Okay. Well, I decided one of my workout outfits I'm just going to wear today in the car. And then, cause we'll work out tomorrow morning probably. So bow these shorts i don't know where i got these well i'm pretty sure bay got me these from my instagram page a couple years ago so i don't i don't know what page but just some mesh shorts is this my side yeah amazing and just a black that. tank before i leave y'all in here let me show y'all my bruises i got beat up at flag football i got that yeah you do and i got that Y'all know about my finger and my knee swollen. Took a lot out of me, y'all. But I gave you a nice rub down. Yeah, you did. Gotta get my baby right. Gotta keep her right. So gave her a rub down. We're not playing. Okay, I got my workout outfits for the trip. These Alphalete tights. If y'all see me in tights, these are like the only ones I wear. 
I actually just bought two more on their website last night because it was a sale. Some more athlete tights. These beige ones are so cute. I love the neutral colors because they can go with so many good like pairings. Workout shirt. A little hoodie. Just probably end up taking that off, but anyways. Then I got some stuff to go to sleep in. My little silk pajama set, you know, gotta be cute. Maybe just something casual. We'll probably do what, just go eat? Yeah. Like uh, tonight or when? Tonight. Tonight. I'm just gonna wear this. Okay, so then whatever I wear now is whatever we're gonna go wear is what, whatever I wear now is what we're wearing to eat tonight. So I need to just put on something casual cause you're gonna wear that. I'm pretty much done packing in. <laughs> <laughs> like it's only a two day trip, so. We're not sightseeing or nothing. We just going to hang out. Yeah. At the hotel. Like a staycation but a different city. Yeah. <laughs> I'll bring this t shirt. <laughs> what? I couldn't get in. Oh. Is that my hoodie? Oh. I thought that was mine, girl. Girl. You know you be wearing my stuff. <laughs> okay, and and you be wearing my stuff, so that's why I asked, is that my hoodie? Because it could have been my stuff. And I thought that that's the same hoodie that I just put in oh. there. Look, I, I just put that hoodie in there that I showed y'all. And I thought that was that hoodie. And I was like, I know you see me put it on my side of the suitcase. <laughs> oh my God, girl. Okay, y'all. We finally got the rental car. A nice Kia. <laughs> I got base set up in the passenger hey, side. Hey, y'all. Already added in for y'all. She's editing the YouTube from Look yesterday. Look at all the snacks she packed for me. She got snacks. She got her lip gloss. She got whatever you want. You got my laptop here. You got my water. Everything. Everything. For my passenger princess. So now we're going to go. Uh, what are we doing? Are we going to Dick's? Yes. We're going to go to Dick's and then we'll get on the road. Yeah, because. You need something because your legs are all cut up from that game, so yeah, I you need, need some, some leggings. Some compression leggings. Yeah. Yeah. I want jerk ribs. We just stopped. We made it. Actually, we're in Memphis, but we're at uh, a jerk chicken food truck. Food truck. We definitely want to get um, jerk ribs. Can we, can we just get the ribs? Okay. Yeah. Just ask me if we could just get the ribs. Jerk chicken plate because I want rice and peas. Okay. And then what did you want? What else? And the pasta. That's With the fine. pasta. Jerk yeah. shrimp and chicken. Jerk shrimp. Yeah. Okay. All right. Can we get? Can we just get the jerk ribs, but no um like no side with it? No ribs. No side. All right. Um. Can we get a jerk shrimp and chicken alfredo? Huh. I'm about to cry. Y'all. Basically, we just got to Memphis. It's 5 p.m. This food truck closes at 6 p.m. And it's so good. Like, the parking lot is filled with people just waiting on their food. Everything is sold out. You don't have no, no more fucking jerk chicken. You don't have no more jerk nothing. So, maybe we'll try to come back while we're still in town. But right now, I'm starving. We need to find somewhere to eat, which sucks because we were really excited because we saw this on TikTok. I'm so stuck. I wanted that pasta so bad. I wanted that pasta so bad. Y'all. I'm so hungry. I probably found that pasta place or that Jamaican place like three hours ago. So this whole time we was really thinking we was about to be eating some jerk food of any kind. Uh, and all of it too. Yeah, we was like, we ordering <laughs> everything. Let's just order everything we want to try. <sighs> but that's okay. We're safe. We, we had a safe drive. Um, we split the drive. Wasn't too bad. Found this place called Central Barbecue. We are on our way there now. Just saw it on TikTok. Nothing crazy. What you think? I mean, it's okay. It sounds good still, honestly. What are you gonna get? Ribs. Oh, yeah. I want like ribs, baked bean, and they got cornbread, cornbread. Ah, okay, I'm excited. You excited again? Yeah. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Please pray that they at least got the food there and they not sold out. We gonna go sit inside and eat? If they gotta sit inside, yeah, we can sit inside. Okay. If you want to. Yeah, I'm down. All right, bet.
Pull it up to the next location. I'm ready. I'm going in with an open mind. What? I'm going in with an open mind. <laughs> and an open belly because we are starving. So I hope it's good. First impressions. Lacking. What? First yeah. impressions are a little bit scary. A little bit like... I don't know, it feels like we went like 50 years back a little bit. Yeah, that's what I'm Like saying. the music, the decor, it feels like kitchen nightmares. Like Gordon Ramsay gonna come in here and be like, let's change everything. It should not look like this no more. I got the heebie jeans. That's just on the ambiance, the decor. It is a TV, TVs are in here, so things were upgraded. Too. All right, so this is what we're working with. It doesn't look as bad on the camera, to be honest. This is what's happening in here. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm in jail. I appreciate it. Everything smells okay. really good. I got a pulled chicken sandwich, greens, uh, potato salad, and coleslaw. Mac and cheese, baked beans, and half a slab of ribs. All right, what are you trying first? The potato salad. Name's all that. Call him by name. A little bit of that. I'm not a huge fan of potato salad though, so my opinion on potato salad can't matter that much. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, that's not bad. We in here. We in there. <laughs> <laughs> Try the greens. Okay. Ooh, now I know what good collard greens taste like. Yeah. I've, had, I've had better. Tastes like water. Let's try the mac and cheese. Tastes like the box mac and cheese. <laughs> Could have did without it. No, I'll try the baked beans. I love me some baked beans, y'all. <laughs> oh, well. Now, the baked beans are the, are the best side here. Like, out of all of these, the baked beans, I'll eat more of. More of. Really? Yeah. I'm going to get a baked beans like a seven. I'm going to try the sandwich. Okay. Mm -hmm. special y'all but Love it's good cool. it'll get the job done now let's try the ribs now the ribs are good Ooh, let me try yeah they're like so are they pork ribs mmm they're like really smoked mm. the ribs are good okay yeah I would get ribs and baked oh, wait, beans oh sauce mmm ooh that's good that is good yeah Alright, right before we started to kind of shut down on them, the ribs kind of got us back. <laughs> and it's crazy because we were going to get jerk ribs over there. Mm -hmm. I had those ribs in my head, so I'm glad we got it. We're going to smash this. And get back to y'all. Those are dead people. <laughs> <laughs> those are dead people. Let's get the fuck out of here. What were you saying? We're starting OnlyFans. This is actually our Kim Kardashian and Ray cut, J moment. Cut, cut. We're having the Kim Kardashian and Ray J moment. Lay down. Lay down. I'm your Uber driver. Lay down. <laughs> I'm your Uber driver. Get in. I didn't order an Uber. We've got one now. We're at the hotel finally. Uh, it took us like 30 minutes to check in because they couldn't find my resi. Oh my God, that front desk clerk or whatever literally talked to us for the whole 30 minutes. We like, no solutions, just no, talking. Just talk. We have a nice hotel. Mm -hmm. it's um, yeah, it's very cozy. We just showered and now we're in bed. We're gonna snuggle. We're gonna go to sleep. <laughs> it was a fun road trip. Sorry we didn't bring you guys, but we were both talking about it like we were just driving. No, yeah, we were just like <laughs> listening to podcasts, you know, talking about like our personal lives, like family and stuff, and it was just nice. Mm -hmm. So we figured we'd check in with y'all after the, the ride. Yeah. But it was like, how long did it take us? Six, maybe like 
five and a half, six hours. Did it? Mm-hmm. So you must have driven for like four, because I only drove for two and a half. Yeah, I drove for a long, a long time. Or three, you drove for three and a half, I drove for two and a half. Mm-hmm. We'll see y'all in the morning. I'm snuggly. I'm going to go officially snuggle my girl. So now I'm gonna go to work. Basically, I'm gonna get her nails done. Well, one, I need to get my nails done. I've been doing really good, y'all. I've been doing good on saving money. I have me getting my nails done. But my toenails look like claws. So it's about that time. I'm gonna get my nails done. I'm gonna get some editing done and film some content for y'all for TikTok and Instagram. Oh, you know what I was thinking? Mm. Like, what, a week and a half ago, we. We're arguing like every day for like probably two weeks. Like it felt like every day we were like. I don't think it was two weeks, but it felt like two. Weeks. It did. How feel long like two was weeks. it? Like probably like five or six days. Like every day. That's a long time to every day we beefing. Not like beefing, but it was like we would have an argument and it was like something going on for like hours. So we kind of made like a half-ass bet. Like let's not. Like we literally we were at a bar. Where were we? We were at a bar, right? No. I thought we were already I, out. Oh, it was before we went out that day. <laughs> we went out that night. Before we went to the bar, we like looked at each other and we were like, <laughs> whatever the fuck is going on, let's just put a stop to it for two weeks and whoever gets upset has to buy the other person whatever they want on their wish list. Because like our, the, the, the problem, the root that we realized, at least this like past time was like, we were just getting defensive of each other. Like, no matter what we said, like, for some reason, we were getting defensive. Yeah. So, that's why our bet was, like, whoever gets mad or, like, stays mad or whatever. Yeah. Because it was just, like, us being defensive. So, um, has to buy the other person something off of their wish mm-hmm. list. And neither one of us got money right now, so. <laughs> <laughs> like, we were talking about it this morning because at the gym, we, we almost got, Lindsay got a little bit defensive. But then it was just like that discussion openly of telling me that she's feeling defensive instead of just being defensive really like changed our entire outlook. And I just wanted to share that. Like it's just like a little tidbit that's been working for us. Because again, things change. There's like ebbs and flows. So this might just be working for us now. We might have to change it up later. Well, I think it's been like two weeks of like, yeah, perfect peaceful serene literally perfect vibes <laughs> and it's not like perfection like things happen where there are it disagreements is. there are arguments but the arguments are like solution oriented um the other person is open about feeling defensive i think that's that changes it like even when i'm open about feeling defensive mm-hmm. you are able to be more understanding of what i'm saying rather than me just like snapping back right and then you being like i don't know where this is coming from but me being too I don't know, I'm not scared, but too prideful to admit that I'm just being defensive. defensive. Yeah, I know. I just wanted to share that with y'all because we argue, things happen, and I know y'all are in relationships. Yeah. Y'all are in relationships and y'all argue, but um, this has been working for us, so. We literally said, all right, let's stop arguing. <laughs> and it worked. That was crazy, though. That was crazy. We had like a long, that was on a Saturday. We had a long day of argument, and we were like, it's not like we be arguing for hours. We just don't talk. So we were like, we miss each other. And we looked at each other and we're like, I miss you. I miss hanging out with you. And now we haven't fucking argued. Mm-mm. It's like, actually, oh my God, you like the Amazon right now. <laughs> I know, what the fuck? 
Literally These loafers are like five inches. Not really, look. Babe, that's a big giant step. Put your shoe back on. Yeah, that's a that's a giant step. One step for mankind. <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> What is it? One step. One, one small step for man, one giant step for mankind. Okay, like she wanna be a fucking asshole. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Yes. <laughs> so I'm about to go to work. Great road trip with my bae. Fun time at the hotel, just chilling, eating. Failure working. on the food. The jerk and food truck. Yeah, fail, failure on that. I still want the jerk chicken and rice, so I'm gonna go get it before we get on the road. You are? Okay, I'm gonna have some of yours then. If you're gonna have some, then I might as well eat it. So we're gonna head back on the road tonight and we'll be back in Atlanta like late tonight. It's gonna be such a long, long day. Yeah, it's gonna be a long day. And we already even worked out, so we're a little bit tired. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We love you guys so much. We'll see you when we see you. And as always, don't forget to like, comment, Subscribe! Bye!